Okay, so now we're going to talk about uh, the number of sunglasses that have been stolen from me throughout my life. When I got my driver's license and I had my first job and I got my first paycheck, I wanted to go get a pair of sunglasses because I had this illegal operation on my eyes that makes them super sensitive to the sunlight. So I found the only one like them in the store, Claire's Boutique in the Slida, Louisiana Mall. They're little silvery, um, cheap, like they were $10 or $20 max. Dragons on the frame right here. Dragons, silver dragons, and the little tail went around each side. Stolen. I presume my sister, you know, sister Erin stole them, or her friend Erin stole them, or her friend Lexi stole them. Someone stole them. I want them back. Then I get like random cheap pairs of sunglasses because I have to have them when I drive. Sunglasses. You can't go buy your own. Then I, I maybe if I buy a nice pair, and the lady says, well, you know, if you if they break or something, just bring back part of them and we'll replace them, like Ray-Bans or something. I didn't even like them that much. They lasted like three days. Three days, gone. 350 pairs of sunglasses, poof, gone. And you can't just go in and say someone stole them. Can I have another pair? No, you can't. So then I go back to the cheap pair of sunglasses. Gone, gone, gone. So then, after the divorce, September 2021, I muster up the courage to go buy another pair of Ray-Bans. I speak to, uh, his name is Houston, he said, at the Sunglass Hut, Alpharetta Mall, North Point Mall, Alpharetta, Georgia. Or it's maybe Roswell, I'm not sure what it is, it's over there. I think they were only $200, as opposed to the $350 ones you stole. Gone and replaced with some crappy version. There was like the, um, I forget what they're called, the, the original like 80s version, and they had like a medium middle version, and I bought the, the newer version. I paid for the newer version, but I get the middle version, and I'm going, well, this isn't what I ordered. So they go missing, stolen, whatever. I go talk to Dallas Williams at the Alpharetta Police Headquarters. He acts like I'm crazy, like he doesn't know who I am, like I haven't reported my cars and my clothes and everything other in my life missing and stolen or whatever. And my contacts missing and stolen or whatever. So I don't even know who it takes to report when I go in. I don't know why he has to look at my ID every time I go in. So I buy another pair, the same glasses, the same sunglasses. They go missing from my car. I didn't leave them in my car. I left them on my bedside table. So I get in my car the next morning and they're in my car. I'm going, well that's weird, they were on my bedside table. Then they go missing from my car. And then they reappear on my bedside table and I'm going, I'm not crazy bitches, leave my sunglasses alone. I'm talking the cheapest, dinkiest little pair from Walmart go missing. It doesn't matter what I do, you fuckers won't leave me alone. That's like at least three grand in sunglasses. You can't afford them? 